So this is the view from school, and I'm trying to figure out how to make a trash eating robot for a school test, a science Cambridge competition, and also for Earth Day. So let me explain. I'm building a trash eating robot, just like what I said in the intro. But before I go into the explanation, I need to explain what in the world I'm building and you guys need to know how this all even started. Now, it started with a class meeting and it's about environment and stuff. So the chemistry teacher asked us to make a project for a summative test, Cambridge competition, which is mandatory by the way, and also Earth Day. We are assigned in a group. My group have me and three other people. And our group landed on trash eating robot because obviously there's me. So now I'm gonna explain how I'm gonna build the actual robot since that's basically all I need to know about how, how I got here in the first place. So yeah. So that was a long explanation, but now I'm gonna tell you how the robot actually works. So the robot is basically this Arduino Uno that's gonna control all these components. So the Arduino Uno acts as the brain of the entire system. Now the Arduino Uno is going to be connected to a motor driver which the motor driver is going to connect to the, to the motor and it's going to move the conveyor belt. So the conveyor belt is going to bring the trash up the robot until it falls in the trash bin. Now the trash bin has an ultrasonic sensor and a servo motor. The ultrasonic sensor is to sense if the trash bin is full and if it is full then the servo will move the trash bin away from the conveyor belt and then the conveyor belt will stop moving because you know you don't want to just overflow the trash bin and make the robot basically useless by spilling the trash back to the river. I don't know why the trash bin has to move, but maybe it just represents the fact that we're gonna take the trash bin away and put it back. So, without further ado, let's move on to the montage and... Alright, now, cue the montage! During the build, a lot of things have to change in like the robot and stuff, so there's a lot of prototypes before this but yeah basically I basically switched out every single thing and then like tried new things and just really really hope it works so yeah it's time to look at the enemy look in the mirror where it appears no friend to me it's not working now maybe it's the chemistry it's time to break up so I can make a better me better believe in your mind cause it's everything you can mold shape find almost anything all it takes is some time and some clarity to find your identity it's mind over everything finally the robot is done and now all we need to do is to cover it up, make it look good, and yeah, there you have it, trash eating robot with a conveyor belt. I know it looks like trash, but you know, we made it out of trash, so we're technically already saving the earth with whatever trash we found on the street, but alright, now it's time to go into the showcase and let's see what score did I get, or did I even win the competition or not. Doing this presentation makes me realize what I want to do in the future, is to make crazy builds solve world problems, and much more. And then after that, remote communities throw trash inside those rivers. But I know there are challenges up ahead. Saving the planet does not, is not this easy, so yeah. So, it's the ending of today's video, hope you guys like the video, if you do, make sure to please subscribe and leave a like, and yeah, oh yeah, by the way, sorry for not uploading for so long, and I see some subscribers slowing down, but I would rather post quality content than some random junk, and maintain the subscriber count, because, you know, it's better to put out good videos and good builds, so yeah, anyways, um, I don't know what to talk about. I don't know if I win the competition or not, but I know I got a hundred, so I think I probably won, but yeah, I'm gonna put in the description below if I won the competition or not, but yeah, that's basically it. Alright, see you next time, bye.